What's up, what's up, good people? It's your girl Experience Mbide. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new here, just remember, remember to hit the subscribe button. Just down below this video, there's, uh, there's, uh, there are some words written subscribe. Eh? Maybe you've not seen them. Just consider subscribing. Then hit the notification bell on so that anytime i upload any video you get notified so welcome back to my returning subscribers and to my new subscribers what's up welcome home i always say that this is home for you so feel so much welcomed yeah so today the video that i'm going to do it's more of maybe reviewing some of your responses mm. that you gave me on instagram it put up a questionnaire something of the sort then you gave me the answers then i say instead of, of reposting them back on instagram why not do a video make it more fun more interactive so that it can also help a lot of people because some of the things that i put there actually all of the things that i put up there are for entertainment so yeah so let's get into the video yeah let's get into the video sorry for that i'm all by myself at home so i'm looking after the baby he's all over so i have also to be very careful so let's start so i wrote them down because there are so many so maybe let me start with the first question i had told you guys to tell me some of your favorite yeah so i'm back my camera fell down <laughs> so i'm back so i was saying the first question that i told you guys to give me some of your responses was some of your favorite movies so it's like we are doing a review of some of your favorite favorite things so let's begin so someone said anything to do with blacks and drama i'm all in i mean <laughs> who is not into black people's drama i'm not a racist disclaimer <laughs> but black people just make a movie so interesting so regarding to this make sure you watch all taylor perry movies yani ziko fit ziko fine hey maybe i'll mention them down below because some of the people listed them so someone else said not a movie but a series manifest best of the best that series, I've watched it and I loved, loved it. Yani, it's so sweet. I don't want to go into details. I want you people to go look for it. It's on Netflix. Yeah, so go search for it. Watch it. Then come back and give me a comment down below. So the next movie is Emily in Paris. So I remember one of my friends gave me this recommendation. I had put up a a question on my whatsapp asking people to tell me movies to watch then emily in paris was one of the suggestions guess what <laughs> i didn't like it so much so maybe when you're my watch you can give me your reviews down below is it good is it nice do you love it how is it yeah so the next one is Ginny and georgia so maybe when listing them down below, you could have maybe told us the genre. I don't know if that's how it's spelled. The genre of this movie, whether it's a romantic movie, an action movie, a rom-com, sitcom, whatever. So I don't know which genre these movies are. Actually, I don't know if they are movies or series, but I think Emily in Paris is a series. Ginny and Georgia looks like a series. Then someone else said she loves horror movies. I also love horror movies. <laughs> Gone are the days when we were small. Ungesh tuliwa. Ati after me watch a, a horror movie, you don't get sleep. Unashinda ukiota, you get nightmares. Nowadays, yani, I just see it as acting. Nothing more. So, I also love thriller and horror movies. Movies in zina kupatia chills and goosebumps kwa mwili. Yeah, I'm spending movies in ziko chilled. I love a movie in itanifanya nikai glued kwa TV. Watching. Yeah, someone else said Witcher. I think I also got this recommendation to watch The Witcher. I, I look into it. So the next one was 365 Days. I think I've watched it. It's a nice movie. This is a movie. People, 
na wapatia suggestions za movies wenye waja watch na nawapatia the best reviews <laughs> yeah the best reviews so any movie that i mention here or a series just know it's a nice one so we go on the next one is love is blind i guess it's a series i've seen it on netflix mm -hmm. nice one i'll check into it then we have either's I don't know if it's a movie or it's a series, but from the look of things, it looks like a movie. Then, as and has not. This is one of the best and best of Taylor Perry series that I've watched. Here, you get all the drama, all the tea. Huh? You, you feel me? <laughs> Taylor Perry movies are the best, I tell you. So if you haven't watched the as and has not, just try go watch it and come and give me a review i watched this series when i was in campus so nikaze <laughs> so the next one is pitch perfect if you love musical movies this one is awesome it's pitch perfect one two and three so make sure you go watch it so we have if loving you is wrong I'm not sure. Is it also a Taylor Perry movie? I'm not very much sure. I don't want to say it's a Taylor Perry movie. Neguesiyo. But it's also a nice series. Eh? Niliacha kami mefika season 6. I don't know kama iliende lea. But this one, I guarantee you, you'll love it. Then we have Descendants. I have not watched it. I hope it's good. Then we have Blacklist. This one, I also watched it while in campus. Hey! I loved it. Loved, loved, loved it. Mm -hmm. It's a nice one. I think it's also on Netflix. Then we have All American. Another black people movie. No, it's a series. Yes. We have All American. It's up to season 4. And we have All American on coming. Season 1 just began. We are at season 1, episode 3. It's a nice one. All American on coming is like a branch of All American. The people acting there were in All American. So, go watch it. Nia Martins. So, movies are Martins. And this year to Jazeka Bado. So I'm very much sure you're going to love it. So the, the last one on the list was Castlevania. Mm -hmm. She said it's on Netflix. Yeah. Go search it on Netflix. Watch it. Then come down below this video and give me a review. So we're done with the movies. So let's go to my followers' favorite games. So here I got some... Huh? <laughs> some responses i can say so someone said i don't have a favorite yet mm, favorite game uh -huh. someone someone else said kati <laughs> i mean who didn't play kati even up to now you find kids playing kati and you feel like just joining them playing just rekindling the moments in the temple okay now now for my followers Kuna masong kore. Eh? Kuna atuwa memoka uku. Someone say table tennis and chess. Eh? Games za watu wa me chill. Kidogo niambi wata golf. <laughs> Someone else say bowling. I've really... L... Uh, nimetamani. I don't know the word in English. Nimetamani sana kufanya bowling. Village market. I'm coming soon. Eh? I, I'll really love to try bowling. It looks really fun. I know it's not expensive. Eh? Those people who have done bowling, you comment down below. Tell me how much is that game? How much is it? Is it affordable? So the next game, someone said swimming and silly games. I don't know how to swim. Mimi ni mkamba, naogopa maji. <laughs> the only water I don't fear, ni enye kwa beseni ya mando. Kwenye inajua hata ni kiingiza mgu siyezi sink. Beach water, swimming pool water, no. Sijui hii uoga ni tatua lini. Mi uona tu ni kiingia kwa maji. I am going to sink. Huh? Sijui, I don't know, I fear water. 
Okay, someone else said none. She doesn't love games. Another person said volleyball. Seems like she played volleyball in high school. Hey, for me, my favorite game, Mimi, I love athletics. I just love athletics. Like I said, in high school, I once participated in cross country. In primary school, I participated in 100 meters race. Right now, can you give me a dog? I've never played any other game. Ball games, I've never. Football, volleyball, I've never played them. I'm just, I'm just that person. Let me say that. I'm not into games that much. But Mimi Ukinipata watching athletics, cheering as if I'm there. That's my kind of games. So the next one was, I told you guys to tell me some of your favorite books. For me, I only love books. The name that's all money pass. Meaning, ni kama niliatia kusoma vile nitoka campus. Don't take me the wrong way. Si kila mu. It's not everyone's cup of tea. <laughs> so someone said, we need more wine by Gabriel Union. I've seen it and someone recommended it. I'll check into it. Maybe it anifanya nianze kupenda books. Then... Someone said, I read books, but I don't remember. Girl, do you read them for fun? Ama, you should be remembering some of the names of the books that you've read. Eh? It's not just reading. Eh? Remember. Then someone said, none. Kama siyo ya shule? None. But I have one, The Alchemist. I've never heard of it. And in I don't love reading books. <laughs> Okay, someone said, why? Mimi see why easy, she doesn't love books. Someone else said, why? Meaning, I've got the same, same hmm? club. We are not loving books. Okay, someone suggested a book called Blossom of the Savannah. From the name, looks like a good movie. Ah, no, sorry, like a good book. <laughs> I love movies so much. That's why in Afikiria, but I'm still talking about movies. So... For the books we done, then we go to some of the favorite places that you visited. So my followers gave me you know, some nice responses. I see people love the the coast. Someone said Diani Beach. I think it's in the south coast. Someone else said Kilifi, Nyahururu, Masai Mara. Oh. So let me tell you guys, there's a difference between a national park and a national reserve. Like Masai Mara, it's a national reserve. A national reserve, it's owned. I know it's a government reserve, but its activities are managed by the county government as compared to the national park, whose activities are managed by the national government. Okay? So you may not understand kwa nini kuna kwanga na some of the places in national parks na zingine zinaitwa national reserves. Reserves are managed by the counties. Okay? Get the difference. Parks are managed by the national government. So in my life nimeshinda kusema even my abi knows. Nimeishi kusema I want to go to Masai Mara. I want to go to Masai Mara. Masai Mara you will find the, the big five. <laughs> the big five are the uh, we have the lion we have the leopard, we have the rhino, we have the elephant, and we have the what? Hey, hey I've forgotten. Anyway, whoever remembers the, the, the last one, they will write below. I'm a wildlifer and I've forgotten the fifth big five animal. Hmm? The fifth one is the buffalo. We also have the small five, but right now I'm not doing <laughs> wildlife classes. Maybe you go Google. So Masai Mara is one of the best places. I've never been there, but I loved all the documentaries I've watched about it. So Masai Mara, also see you soon. Yani my bucket list is full. Iko imeja, iko packed. <laughs> okay, the, the next place is the Malindi. You see, people love the coastal parts of Kenya. Then we have like Kipia. Someone said it has the beautiful sceneries over there. Like Kipia, like Kipia. Nduko kuna... Na ikipi it's a county, nikuwa kuna nanyuki, nanyuki uko ndi kuna easy places kama Mayan. So, I think it's a nice place. 
someone else said i guess i haven't explored enough for now okay lake naivasha i've been there boat riding then we have Hell's gate hmm. some of the best places to visit in kenya Hell's gate is in the list apple the activities like riding bicycles there are activities like climbing rocks so it's a nice place the, the, the last time we were there we went to an in campus then the guy tells you about the flash flood that comes out of nowhere killing people yani it's a beautiful place at the same time it's a <laughs> fierce place to go to but it's nice i think even one of our kenyan bands ametoa um, song sapo i think sauti sol song with the mialade was shot in elsgate to showcase how beautiful our country is so manze if you've not visited any of the national parks or national reserve please do so <laughs> then we have the nanyuki you see it's mentioned here then go nakuru i've been to nakuru i think so mombasa it's like my second home nairobi where we are then someone else said kwetu their place their place is the best i think it's machakos <laughs> then someone else said afro sayari there's a video that i did there where we went to the babies to swim we were at afro sayari it's top notch then we have the spa mall yeah so i was saying spa mall um, some of my this year's resolution was to make sure i visit maybe almost all all the malls in nairobi i visited some but yatembea mingi sana i think nimeenda to rivers nimeenda southfield mall nimeenda ingine iko soki mall i visited around five last year we went to i kwa bathi karot i keep forgetting the name so i've gone to around five so make sure you go to these malls experience what everyone else experiences they are nice places to visit they are built for us eh? then she said rainbow resort then a very lounge this is the i think a very lounge. this is the first place that i met diana but it's a nice place then i asked you people to tell me some of your favorite apps so, a lot of people voted for instagram <laughs> it's the best place but udaku eh? no one mentioned telegram <laughs> but instagram is a nice place where people want to just younger their pictures because media filters you see then whatsapp it's the best for communication you just buy some bundles so you connect your phone to wi-fi then you are able to text a lot of people you are able to send pictures send videos so it's it's good for that then we have youtube mm -hmm. youtube yeah you get to to see the trending things yeah it's nice i also love it because that's where i put my content <laughs> yeah so someone else said green up i've never had this app green up i put the person who commented this to explain more i've never heard of an app called a god green up this is this is so 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 new to me then we have snapchat i know why people love snapchat because of filters when enda wana filter pictures uko snapchat then wanakuja wanatoka ig bado wanakuja wanaongezea filters za ig <laughs> hey, people hey. Hmm. Mm -hmm. then tiktok who doesn't love tiktok manze mimi when i get down on my phone mimi nikiingia tiktok mimi wanaenda tu kuzuba hapo cuz the videos ni ziko hapo oh god nice sometimes i feel myself trying some of the challenges ni ziko hapo so i'm not a very good dancer <laughs> you know that but i'm going to try the only the only kind of dancing i've ever done it's salsa dancing that one i'm good at it ni vile sifanyangi practice i used to do it when in campus that one iko kwa but fast fast dancing i'm not so good so tiktok iko fit pia kujua what trending hapo no one mentioned twitter na twitter ndio inafanyanga inatuletanga udaku and no one mentioned facebook facebook is outdated oh god then 
I told you people to tell me some of of your favorite YouTube videos. Forgive me, I'm doing this video very fast before baby Anzo Purusha tantrums. Hey baby. Hey baby. So some of people's favorite YouTube videos, they say the most. That is Michelle Roger, Diana Bahati's sister. Then someone else said Diana Bahati. Someone else said Convo Corner, it's by Millie Chebi. It's a nice one where they have very nice discussions. Then someone else said mine. Our YouTube channel is a favorite. I'm not mentioning names. <laughs> then someone said Ile Di Alipewa Hao. So definitely she loves Diana Bati's video. Then someone else said she loves pranks. Zilini Shinda, by the way. Then I see I have a lot of Diana Bati's fans. Here someone said she loves all Diana Bati's, Michelle Ngojes, Chebi, Mili Chebi. Then she also loves JND family, that is Joe Brizzy and Haley. Then someone else said she loves pranks and surprises. Yeah, so that's it for the YouTube video. So, for the last segment, I told you guys to tell me some of your favorite songs. For me, I love R&Bs. They have been my cup of tea since I knew what songs are. Me and my cousin, we used to carry my grandma's radio. Kila mahali. So long as you gonna battery. Tukua a dog to give a tukila mahali just listening to Kiss one hundred. They used to play the best and best of R and B's. So some of your responses, gospel and reggae. Someone says she loves sad songs. Why do you love sad songs? Why don't you love mm, sweet songs? Why don't you love sweet songs or love songs? Mm -hmm. Then someone had say she loves bongo. Yeah, bongo are nice. Ziko fiti, huh? Though you don't. Kenyans support local music. <laughs> then Mr. Man by Fev. I don't know which one is that one. Then someone else said any song for as long as it's a vibe. Then all the Anabi songs in Bahati. Now, here comes my cup of tea, love songs. Yeah, R&B, most of R&Bs are love songs. Then we have Little Mix. Mm -hmm. I love that band. It's a nice one. Then someone else said, Atuachani, Adiyambo, Sweet Darling, Bishima. She just mentioned the names. Nah, it's okay. Then Shirua GP. Then R&Bs and all Kikuyu songs. So, those were some of the responses that you gave me on Instagram. So, soon and very soon, I'm going to put up another questionnaire there. I want you guys to tell me some of your darkest secrets that you've never told anyone. I'm not going to mention names. I'll make another video, maybe reacting to those secrets that you're going to tell me on IG. So, make them as sweet as they can. Mm -hmm. so that the video can also be sweet i'm not going to be judging anyone so thank you so much for participating in my little questionnaire and helping me make this video i love you so much guys continue subscribing continue sharing my link to your friends we are growing guys we are on the road to a thousand subscribers so let's make this happen subscribe give the video a thumbs up yeah and please come back again and watch my videos. Bye till the next time. I love you guys.